Mario, the dust has settled a little bit since that um, uh, another late show at Carrow. Can you just sum up your emotions for us? What should I say? I'm just buzzing. Uh, unfortunately, we couldn't get a win. We played very well, I think. Um, yeah, Sheffield made us very difficult. Uh, yeah, made it very difficult for us, and yeah, it was a big relief when I scored the last goal. Yeah. Yeah, and what was going through your head when you were stepping up to take that free kick and the, with the last kick of the game? It was. Uh, to be honest, there was no doubt. I was practicing. I've been practicing uh, them. Yeah almost every day and um, for those moments they're very important for us <laughs> especially in the last second and um, yeah I was, I was sure I'm gonna score. Yeah because we often see you um, training before the team comes out um, for the start of the game, training late when the team's gone in back down the tunnel so it must be immensely satisfying when stuff like that come off in a big moment. Obviously definitely uh, as you said <laughs> even before the game I'm, I'm practicing them um, yeah, what should I say? I'm, I'm just buzzing that, that I could have, I could score this goal, this very important goal for us, and uh, yeah, three more to go. Yeah, and we've seen um, at late scenes like celebrations right at the end. Then we've seen it so many times at Carrow Road this season. What does that say about the character of this team? <sighs> Simple. Uh, we never give up. Never, never. Or, um, we scored, I think, like almost 10, 10 goals or 12 goals in the last minute, and it just shows our character, our team spirit, uh, especially uh, at home uh, with the supporters. It give, gives us a big boost, and as I said, we never give up. Yeah, and a lot, a lot of things went against us today, a couple of decisions. What did you make of the, uh, the goal from Fletcher, first of all? It looked like he went in off his arm. To be honest, I didn't see it, and yeah, it's, it's not, my, not my business to comment the referee. I think uh, yeah, it's always difficult. Um, especially in a game like that, like an important game like that, and it's not my business to com comment in. Yeah, for, for you on a personal level, I mean, obviously over the last couple of months you've not been featuring too much in the starting eleven. You're having to come on with cameo appearances late on. How are you finding watching things from the bench? <laughs> obviously, every <laughs> difficult question. <laughs> every, play, every player wants to play, and sometimes you just just need to uh, yeah use your minutes you get. If it's five minutes, ten minutes, doesn't matter. Um, of course, I would like to start as uh, any other player in the team, and um, yeah, what shall I say? Hopefully, uh, yeah, hopefully I can start a game very soon. But when you come on late on, does that make you even more um, hungry to make a make an impact and show the boss what you can do? Yeah, it's always important to get a contribution in a game, and um, yeah, especially with goals and uh, and stuff. And yeah, what should I say? I'm just trying to uh, to give my best, and um, yeah, somehow to convince the boss to to uh, to give me more minutes or uh, start uh, put me from the yeah from the minute one. Yeah, and the point um, puts us five clear of. Um, the teams below us with just um, three games left to go. How much of a psychological boost is that late equaliser going to give the boys in the games ahead? Uh, obviously, a big one, very big. Um, yeah, it shows it shows our character, character as I said, and uh, it gives us a big, 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 big boost. Uh, yeah, as I said, unfortunately we couldn't we couldn't manage to to win the game, but um, yeah, we can also be happy with a point. I think you can't win every game, and uh, yeah. We are, we are looking forward for the last three games. And how important was the um, support of the fans today? Because at times in the game it wasn't quite going our way, but they really stuck by us, didn't they? Obviously, it's very important for us. Every game at home is, is like, it's our own living room. We are very, very strong at home. And um, yeah, what should I say? Big thanks to the supporters that they uh, support us uh, in either, either situation. Yeah, and hopefully that late equaliser will give us a little bit of a boost going to Stoke on um, mm. Monday, another important game, as you've, as you've mentioned. Um, they beat us here at Carroll Road in the previous fixture. What can we take from that game going into the one at the Bet365 Stadium? Uh, don't know. <laughs> it's, a, it's a new game, a totally different game. Um, we play away. Also, we are, away, uh, we are very strong away. But, yeah, let's, let's just yeah, calm down a bit. Just focus on the last three games. I think that's very important. Uh, take those emotions into the game to to Stoke and and try to win it. Yeah, and we've got three thousand fans travelling up to us for Stoke. How important is that togetherness going to be for the boys? Ah, oh, very huge. As uh, as uh, the last week in, uh, at Wigan, it's always nice to have so many away supporters. And yeah, what should I say? A big thanks to them for the travel, and uh, hopefully we can we can make them happy on uh, on Monday.